Welcome back, my friends, to another Leal Legacy Classic Cartoon Commentary. Today, we're hanging out with that OG Looney Tune himself, Bosco, in Bosco's Holiday from 1931. July 15th, 1931, to be precise, directed by Hugh Harmon and Rudolph Issing. Issing? Issing. Issing. Starring Rochelle Hudson. As Honey and Johnny Murray as Bosco. Man, that 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 alarm clock has a great mustache. I really enjoy how they bent the arms to make it mustachioed. And I guess to act as the bottom of the eyes a little bit. Brilliant. All the way around. Oh no, he's panicked. Oh no, oh no. He knew he was supposed to be working. Now he's worried. Now what was that? A bedpan? Was that a bedpan? <laughs> Underneath Bosco's bed? <laughs> Hit him. Hit him in the head. That's what the phone told him to do. Oh my gosh. Is he gonna do it? He is. Oh no! Way more aggressive. Hey, the mustache turned into arms. How'd that happen? Now I... I mean, he barely looked like a clock at all. No, he's a sleepy Bosco. <laughs> Who is it? Oh, it's it's Honey. Yeah, of course it's Honey. Who else would be calling Bosco? I know, right? Why? <laughs> Why are you guys speaking so slowly? Oh yeah, a picnic sounds great. A picnic? Oh, baby. <laughs> Wow, a little demanding, but that's okay. Okay, baby, that was honey, not baby. Wrong girlfriend, Bosco. What'd that phone say? Lala. Oh, done deal. Where did the Where did his shirt come from, though? He jumped into a pair of pants, but hmm. Ah, there we are. Uh oh. I don't think that's how it works. <sighs> I, uh, I really want to ride in one of those old-timey crank cars. I'm sure it can be done. I just need to find the right resource to supply the car. There's got to be some, some outrageous motobile, 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 automobile <laughs> collector out there. Oh boy, my brain is. Hey, look, it's a not, not Mickey Mouse. Again, it's a not not Mickey Mouse because it has no shorts. In order to be a not Mickey Mouse, it would need shorts. So almost there, but not quite. Oh, that my my mouse tails don't detach like that and just grow back. It's not a lizard. Yeah, I'd be mad too. Bite him. Oh wait, never mind. What are you so mad about? <laughs> You're still gonna act as the hood ornament too. You know that mouse wasn't there when the car came out of the garage. Aha! Get him now. <laughs> oh, tail pop back out. Grab it now! Grab it! Grab it, Bosco! I don't know whose side I'm on. It was adorable. It was really cute. <laughs> I'm gonna start saying ain't that cute more in my everyday life. I don't say that enough. So whose bow came first? Honey's or Minnie Mouse's? So this is 1931, 1928, Steamboat Willie, Minnie Mouse had a hat, so not yet a bow. I'm willing to bet Honey's bow came before Minnie's bow. And it's polka dotted too. Oh look at the sweet little puppy jumping on the exhaust. That's adorable. What a what a fun little added tidbit that could so easily go overlooked. Um I was gonna say, why are you going up a hill? But I mean, like a prime pick a picnic, pick up a prime picnic spot would have a view. So I, I imagine that's why there's a necessity to go uphill. Maybe hike. Whoa, Bosco! I didn't know you were the type to kick a puppy. It was just being adorable. That's all. Don't put your mouth on that. Don't put your mouth on that. Oh, this is this is not gonna end well. Oh, well, a little bit of tire licking. Oh, there we are. 
That was a lot of air in that little unassuming tire. I'm gonna pump it back in. Yeah, there we are. All right, I kind of get why you wanted to kick the puppy now, Bosco. I mean, I wouldn't do it myself, but... Um, yeah, it's really annoying. I'm sorry, buddy. Ah. Took the out, he made it an innie. <laughs> Pick it and you just don't want to try up the hill anymore? I mean, it's probably not like a really hard walk. I bet it's, it seems like pretty tough for your car to get up, but... I mean... Uh, that's a really long log across a really long lake. Pond? It was more of a pond. Here we go. Um, I feel like sitting on the ground. Oh, what, Bosco? What are you? Something not appropriate, apparently. Come on, man. Keep it together. <laughs> I wonder what he asked for. I wonder what he said. Nothing that can't be fixed. A little sandwich. Eat it really loud so she knows. <laughs> Good job, Bosco. Show is fine. Um, what kind of sandwich do you think it is? Peanut butter? It looks kind of peanut buttery. I personally prefer a peanut butter honey <laughs> than a peanut butter jelly. Yeah, you knew. You knew who to lure her back in. What a sandwich. Oh. There, oh, okay. I wonder if that's what he talked about earlier. Do you think that's what he whispered in her ear? <laughs> and that's why she wasn't su necessarily surprised that he did it? Yeah, I'm nuts, man. Well, don't... <laughs> I have... I have a really... Really, uh... <laughs> sinking suspicion that um, Bosco may have asked to lick Honey's butt. I don't know. I don't know. That's just the pieces of the puzzle that I'm putting together based on what had happened. I'm not trying to be crass. I'm not trying to be lewd. But look at just look at what look at the facts that we have available to us. And you tell me if you come up with a different conclusion. You probably won't because I mean. <laughs> See you later.